Do you guys have a Oculus Quest 2? And are you trying to get Airlink set up to stream wirelessly from your PC to your headset? Great, I'm gonna teach you all the tips you need to know in under just a few minutes. First off, make sure there's a hardware connection from your PC to your router. That's ethernet, baby. Two, go into your Oculus debug tool in the file structure of your Oculus install app. Find this, go to link sharpening, make sure that's enabled. If you need to know how to access this specific file, try Google. Next, go into your headset. When your headset's on, after you have your link enabled and you're streaming from your PC to your headset, you'll be able to see this like you were before if you had used a Rift. Go to the leftmost menu, Oculus Air Link, and ensure you have dynamic on and max out your bitrate. This will depend on your system specs and what you can run. Third, go into the Oculus app. Go into Devices, go to Quest 2 and Touch. Scroll down all the way to the bottom. Click Graphics Preferences. In here, max out to the settings which you desire. 90 hertz at 1.2x is what I can run with my 2070. Last but not least, once your headset is on, to find the perfect angle for these Fresnel lenses, it requires a bit of tweaking. Once the headset is on, close one eye. That's the tip here you need to know. Close one eye, focus on text or a specific point on the screen. Let's say you're playing a shooter, focus on the crosshairs with one eye closed and manipulate the headset up and down, up and down, left and right, and manage all the ways tweaking on your head until you find the sweet spot. Then tighten up that top strap or the back so that it doesn't move. You can also mark the head strap for a pro tip. Last but not least, with these Fresnel lenses and the IPD settings, with the Quest 2, you only have three settings, one, two, and three, but actually, if you move them in between, the lenses will stay there. Check your IPD by measuring your pupils and the distance between them in a mirror or using a smartphone app. And that's all you need to know to get this bad boy streaming wirelessly from your PC with all your apps and games. Good luck.